a lead gen site here and we'll make a new post. All right, and then we're going to go over to our monster content uh, file that was delivered. And right now you can see I'm on 29, so pretty much I just copy and paste this whole HTML code. Uh, where does it end? It's right here. All right, go over to text and just paste that in. All right, and you'll see how it looks. And you'll see there's three spots that have a short code um, place. And what you do is after you create all your pages, then you can go in and you can change these short codes to anything you want, and it'll generate across all pages. So if you have a new client or, um, you know, for any reason you need to change a phone number, whatever these short codes are, you can show, um, change that. And I'll show you that in a little bit. So I copied and pasted that in. Then it's in Louisville, so I just go city, then state abbreviated. All right, now if I already have the state, I don't have to add the category, but I don't have this one yet. So Kentucky locations, and then I'm going to set the featured image, and I'm going to geotag it. So I'm going to go over to Snappa, which is a great tool for quick image editing, image editing and stuff like that. All right, so set a featured image. Banner Louisville. <clears throat> All right. For anchor text, uh, I don't like to get too crazy because when I'm creating all these pages, I'm going to repeat some anchor text, so I just really try to keep it random, but that makes sense. So, window replacement, banner, Louisville. All right, that's what it is. It's a window replacement banner. So, it's got some keywords in there, and it's accurately describing the image. All right, then I go to a Project Supremacy plugin, which is a great plugin. I use it for a lot of different sites. Put in the city. It'll give us the coordinates. We will save. And now our featured name is geotagged for <clears throat> each city page is going to be geotagged for that location, which is pretty nice also. Then I go down here and you can mess with the uh, meta titles and descriptions. And uh, I'll mix them up a little bit. You know, just keyword, different keyword city. Um, it's going to generate a pretty good meta description. If you want to take a little more time and fill that in, you know, it's definitely a, a good idea also. And then one thing I just, the way mine's set up, I like to turn that off because the way these pages are generating, they're already having an H1 right here. So I don't want the title to be used. All right. All right, so that's pretty quick. Let's check it out. All right. So on the next image I do, I'm going to scoot the text down here a little bit, make sure that um, it's more even. But the, there's the ads, and then there's the uh, one of the short codes right now that's for an affiliate number for a window replacement. Oh, another affiliate number in video. So if I wanted to, after I create these uh, 1,000 pages, then I can just change the short code one time, and this whole banner can change over to something else, a different nationwide client or a different 
you know, affiliate offer that's going on that's relating to a window and door replacement. So just a pretty good place to, um, you know, place advertisements. Another thing you can do is if you have a client that wants um, leads for a whole a whole state, what you can do is all these different city pages, you can put them all in one group and then change the banner just for that group. So you could have all your Arizona city pages with banners for your local client and all your other city pages for different states would still have, you know, different banners for other projects. So you can really turn one strong domain into a site that's able to generate visitors, you know, and revenue from all different states. So pretty, pretty great stuff. And uh, I'll, I'll run through it one more time real quick just so you can see how easy it is to create these great pages. All right. Now you got to remember that these are, you know, computer generated, but I've used spinning software and stuff and I've used workhorse plugin and I, I mean, I have spin rewriter, so I've definitely tried to spin a lot of city pages and I've had success with it on some of my other videos. If you um, watch them, some other plugins I use, it, they definitely generate visitors and stuff like that. But this way, Man, it's just some really well-written text as far as being computer-generated. So after I create this one, we'll look it over real quick to see how it how it reads. So you see how boring it is to be uh, an SEO. It's not all fun and games. It's a lot of repetitive um, little annoying stuff and little details that you have to keep in mind. But, you know, gets the job done. There we go. Give it a quick geo tag. And if you guys have any questions about some of the plugins I use and where to get them or where to get good deals on them, training groups that you know people are in where we talk about the different plugins and different strategies, you know, trade secrets and tips, um, definitely feel free to contact me. You know, I love talking SEO. If if you're an SEO already, you want to connect or work on some projects together, I'm definitely open for that. Finish this page up here real quick. All right, should be good. Got Oregon in there. You know, better safe than sorry. Just to look over the little, <clears throat> little details. All right, so we'll check this one out. We'll give it a quick look over and see how this uh, computer-generated text worked out. <laughs> Glass Company near me is our company. It's our way of saying that we're in your neighborhood. We have the trusted pros for serving you with the replacement, repair, and installation of windows and doors. All types of them, from French doors to sliding glass and patio doors, even Arcadia doors. As local window, I'd say that's that's pretty well written. And it's, it's great. It's got tons of different keywords and keyword variations. You know, I think there are over 1,300, 1,400 words of text on here. And it, the titles all have pretty, uh, 
I mean window repair, door and window repair, and installation, skilled door and window installation, repair contract. I mean, this is just I'm just putting these on here today, so I'm going to have to do another video in about a month or so, and we'll see uh, what kind of rankings we're going to get out of this, because I'm excited to give this a try, so I will let you know how it goes. Keep in touch. Thanks.